As the topic of gay marriage has become something that's discussed widely and often with great passion, I began to realize that the point of view that many people had was totally unfounded and unfair. Religion is used so often as a wedge in this issue. I'm living with a son who experienced three years of um, the greatest pain before he come out. The fact that, that I don't have the right in the state I grew up in to be married in a loving relationship with the person that I adore and to celebrate that without any interference. I'm hurt by casting a ballot in favor of Proposition 8 that denies the right to marry. It hurts me and people like me. It makes me sad that my children have to know that our society is not a free society and that we are legally discriminating against people that they love. As a minority, they must have the same rights as everybody else. The right is to have a piece of paper that entitles you to be recognized as a married couple. I think that those of us who are for equality in marriage uh, have a lot of work to do in terms of educating, supporting, and advocating, and bringing on board a number of people who are on the sidelines right now. We have to hold ourselves accountable for recognizing that change like this happens through persistence, and that those of us who can be vocal and can be supported have to be vocal and have to be supportive. Those that do nothing, those who say, well, I'm neutral, I'm just gonna pass on it, are as much a part of the problem as those who are out there in the streets trying to keep us from attaining that civil right.